Good afternoon, folks. This morning, we looked at this long-duration, high-range M-class solar flare near center disk, which released a very strong CME. We showed the flare and resulting plasma ejection on SOHO. We forecast level 2 or 3 solar storm conditions when it impacts, but said that level 4 was possible if it arrived very quickly and had southern magnetism embedded within it. Well, NOAA has finally updated their forecast and predicts level 3 conditions tomorrow and level 4 conditions on June 2nd. And this is despite their models having the CME arrive 12 to 18 hours later than the NASA model we showed this morning. Solid, high-density impact, plasma speed near 1,000 kilometers per second. If that's what we get, even that late, and it has southern magnetism, then I agree totally. We could see level 4 storms probably about 50-50 between that level 4 and level 3. It is worth noting that the proton surge has crested into storm levels as well now, still in low range and only a concern for satellites and polar flights. But we've got the CME on its way and the big sunspots still directly facing Earth. They have kept up the M-class flaring, but no more CME releases. We will keep watching. Folks, there's virtually no chance this is a Carrington-level solar storm, the solar kill shot, but I'm very anxious to see how our magnetic field matches up with the incoming plasma shock wave. Hopefully, it is slower than expected. Hopefully, it doesn't have south-pointing magnetism. The next 24 hours will tell the tale. I will see you in the morning for the Daily Show. Be safe, everyone.